wonderful people of God. Today is the 6th of May 2020 and we are on day 127 of our daily memory verse challenge. So we are firing forward and we'll keep moving. Nothing is stopping us. Okay? So my memory verse for today is taken from the book of Galatians chapter 5 verse 2 and it says listen I Paul tell you this if you are counting on circumcision to make you right with God then Christ will be of no benefit to you okay so some people some people think that oh being righteous is based on the amount of laws you keep okay and because of that they don't really appreciate what christ did for us christ coming to die for our sins they'll be like ah well yes i know you came to bail me out but um never mind i got this i got this i can do it by myself i can just live a holy life i can just do good i could just be generous give um to the poor you know i could dress cover myself up and not do makeup not uh, wear certain types of clothes i could um not braid my hair you know this way do it this way or that way no 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 it's not by what you do or what you don't do that's not the qualification of being righteous or being you know right in the eyes of God because remember the scripture says that our self-righteousness is like what filthy filthy dirty very dirty rags not even dirty clothes dirty rags in the eyes of God it means nothing it's irritating without Jesus okay so we need to base our righteousness or we need to base our acceptance with God on what Jesus did for us by shedding his blood to cleanse us because our works the abiding you know keeping those laws is not the thing that will cleanse us from our sins no is Jesus so if you are just sticking to your own good ways I mean it's good to be good be, keep being good but if you are thinking that that's what will help you to cross as in make it into God's kingdom to get God's approval then that means you are you are disregarding what Jesus has done and you're like ah this doesn't benefit me I don't need it so that's arrogance that's not appropriate okay so let's be good but don't rely on your self-righteousness rely on Jesus okay so don't worry we'll dwell on this particular chapter as we keep going down the chapter I'm sure we'll get more um, we'll get more understanding about what this is all about okay so I encourage us read ahead read ahead read ahead and not just reading this chapter However, the Spirit of God directs you. Just make sure you are reading your Bible. Meditate on it. You know, dwell on it. Let the Spirit of God minister to you the, the knowledge He's trying to pass across to you. Okay, for that particular verse or chapter. All right. But I encourage you and challenge you to memorize at least one verse a day. But most importantly, do what the bible says you should do okay so have a lovely night and i hope to see you tomorrow by god's special grace bye bye